This heartwarming story unfolded in September 2017. Tammy Oswalt eagerly anticipated a delightful meal with her daughter, arriving early at their chosen venue. Little did she know, her eldest daughter had orchestrated a birthday surprise of profound significance. It was a gift so meaningful that, in her daughter's own words, it was something that money can't touch. What could this priceless gift be? Perhaps a lavish diamond ring or something equally extravagant? Tammy Oswald, however, wasn't one to relish surprises. Unlike those who delight in unexpected gestures, she typically shunned them, expressing a dislike for surprises altogether. Yet, sometimes, even the most apprehensive individuals find themselves enchanted by surprises that exceed their expectations. Would this surprise from Sammy be the extraordinary, life-changing moment she claimed it to be? Many parents, like Tammy, often downplay their desires, preferring to give rather than receive. Tammy had made it clear to her daughters that she didn't want gifts, only cherished moments with her loved ones. Little did she know, her subtle cues had been noted by her daughter, who was determined to honor her mother's wishes while expressing deep gratitude for the comfortable life Tammy had provided. Though Tammy hadn't anticipated any gifts from her children, she was about to discover that the greatest gifts often come when least expected. Even when someone plans a surprise for us, we often find ourselves growing a bit suspicious or noticing peculiar behavior. Similarly, there was a hint that Oswald picked up on as Sammy prepared to surprise her. Sammy's action of pulling out her phone and turning on the camera raised a slight suspicion in Tammy's mind. Tammy anticipated receiving an extraordinary gift from her daughter, described as incredible presents. She graced herself for something unique, but nothing could have prepared her for what was to come. When we undertake something special for someone, we often feel compelled to share it with others, even those who couldn't be present. Fortunately, Sammy wanted to share this momentous occasion with her friends. As Sammy prepared her mother for the surprise she had been working on in secret, she offered her a word of caution. She wanted her mom to be mentally prepared before unveiling the surprise. Thus, she warned her with the words, you know how I do random, unexpected stuff, right? It was enough to stir up anticipation and perhaps a touch of anxiety. With emotions running high and tension palpable in the room, Sammy finally revealed the surprise she had been keeping from her mom. There was nothing that could have prepared Tammy for what she was about to hear. In a moment that would forever change their lives, Sammy announced to her mother, I want you to meet your son Dylan. Tammy was stunned by this revelation, unable to believe the words that had just been spoken by her daughter. Was this young man truly her son, and where had he come from? Tammy found herself facing a multitude of questions and explanations after this shocking revelation. It turned out that Tammy's past was far more intricate and intriguing than anyone could have imagined. This was her son, whom she had not seen for a staggering 18 years, a child she had to give up in the past due to an unplanned pregnancy. Upon spotting her long-lost son, Oswald wasted no time in rising to her feet and enveloping the young man in a tight embrace. Her son returned the gesture, and the two of them held each other for what felt like an eternity. Who could blame a mother and son who had been separated for 18 years? Meanwhile, her daughter Hewitt captured this emotional reunion on film. For Tammy Oswalt and her family, this was an incredibly emotional and precious moment. It was truly one of the best surprise gifts she had ever received. As Tammy and her son attempted to make up for lost time with their embrace, Sammy looked on, offering her heartfelt birthday wishes to her mother. The young man in the video was indeed Oswald's long-lost son, a secret she had kept hidden for years. Back in the late 1990s, Tammy was a single mother struggling to raise her two daughters. When she discovered she was pregnant again, the situation became even more challenging. Unplanned pregnancies often lead to difficult decisions, such as adoption. However, there was a complicating factor. Tammy had separated from the father of her unborn child before she even knew she was pregnant. Facing financial struggles and the prospect of homelessness, Tammy knew she could not provide the care her baby deserved. 
Abortion was not an option, so she made the heartbreaking decision to put her baby up for adoption. Some may criticize her decision, but Tammy's actions were incredibly selfless. Every choice she made was in the best interest of her son, aiming to provide him with a future she could not guarantee on her own. Adoption, she believed, would offer him the opportunities and support he needed to thrive in life. Tammy's heart ached at the thought of giving up her newborn son. It was her first son, and the idea of parting with him haunted her every night. Despite her deep desire to keep him, she knew it was in his best interest to go through with the adoption. It was an agonizing decision, but one she felt compelled to make for his well-being. When the time came for her to give birth, Tammy experienced both joy and sorrow. While she was ecstatic to welcome her son into the world, she also knew that she would have to relinquish him on the same day. The pain of saying goodbye was indescribable, made even more difficult by the fact that she had no one to lean on for support. Tammy's anguish was palpable as she reflected on the experience. In interviews, she expressed the deep sorrow and inadequacy she felt at having to give up her child. A mom doesn't give up her child like a sack of potatoes, she lamented. Despite her love for him, she believed that she couldn't provide him with the life he deserved. The aftermath of giving up her son took a toll on Tammy's mental health. She fell into a deep depression, grappling with overwhelming feelings of guilt and loss. At one point, she even contemplated suicide. It was a dark and challenging time for Tammy, but eventually she found the strength to push through and begin the healing process. As the years passed, Tammy learned to cope with her grief, but thoughts of her son remained ever-present in her mind. Similarly, her son Dylan often thought about his mother throughout his life. In 2017, he finally mustered the courage to reach out to her, finding her daughter's contact information. The revelation of these secret conversations came as a shock to Tammy. She felt a mix of emotions, including surprise, amazement, and a hint of anger. Questions flooded her mind as she processed this unexpected turn of events. Despite the whirlwind of emotions, Tammy remained open to reconnecting with her son. When Dylan felt ready to speak to her directly, she welcomed the opportunity with both trepidation and hope. While she longed to ask him countless questions, she also understood the importance of allowing him to share his story in his own time. Above all, she hoped that their eventual meeting would bring healing and closure to both of them. The perfect moment for their reunion came just days after their phone call, on Oswald's birthday. Dylan surprised her at the restaurant, leaving Oswald overwhelmed with emotion. Reflecting on their reunion, she shared, The moment I looked back and saw him, so much ran through me. There was so much love, I just wanted to hold and kiss him. In a 2017 interview, Tammy described her reaction to meeting Dylan for the first time, saying, as soon as my daughter said, meet your son, Dylan, I broke. I waited almost 19 years for this moment. All I could do was say, oh my God, I love you. You're beautiful. It was a deeply emotional moment for her to see the child she had to give up years ago. As it turned out, Dylan and his mother lived just 90 minutes apart. Eager to learn more about each other, they spent as much time together as possible. One of their first outings was to Dylan's soccer match, a milestone event for Oswald to witness. For Tammy, Dylan's presence was a gift that filled a void in her life. She embraced their reunion wholeheartedly, expressing, I feel so complete now. Everything I ever wanted, I now have. I've got what matters and that's family. It was a second chance for her to create meaningful memories with her son. When Christmas approached, Tammy extended an invitation for Dylan to join her in celebrating the holiday. Both families agreed it was the right decision, marking Dylan's first Christmas with his biological mother. The festive gathering was a heartwarming experience for everyone involved, creating cherished memories. Feeling welcomed and accepted by his biological mother's family, Dylan embraced his newfound sense of belonging. He made efforts to visit them regularly, bringing joy to Tammy and her family. Even Sammy, Tammy's daughter, was delighted to have a new brother, solidifying the sense of completeness within the family.